mail ward. Oh, not the mail ward. It's all full of cum. Yeah, if you had to be an orderly, would you rather have to look after males or females? Fuck, I don't know. Well, both are pretty horrible, I think. Yeah. At a place like this, you mean? This, or like the one in American Horror Story. At least in American Horror Story, you might get a sexy nympho. Yeah. Maybe. <laughs> Probably do the women just, you know, in case. Well, you might get a nympho with the men too. Sure. Guy yeah, but really I don't like men. I don't like men. Hey. I don't like men. If a man promised to give you the best blowjob you ever had, I would take it. Yeah. That's what I thought. And feel really uncomfortable about it. Just close your eyes. Gets easier the more you do. Helps if you just think of him as a girl with a dick. Yeah. <laughs> now, uh. Fraser, don't be picky. <laughs> don't I be told choosy. You, there are two people in this world that I am very envious of. One is Jews. Mm -hmm. The other is gay men. Mm -hmm. If I could be a gay Jewish man, I'd be... Oh, my God. Have it fucking made. <laughs> have a great family who would totally accept that I'm gay. <laughs> Have the best bar mitts forever. Uh huh. Kiss my first boy, and then get nonstop action for the rest of my life because men love to have sex. Mm -hmm. Women do too, but men just have no. A little more casual about it. I think. No prerequisites for it. What kind of gay men have you been? Nah. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> gay men right, are ready right. for action any given time. It may be a, it may be a stereotype. Kind of, um, maybe a little bit of one, but it's but still, just like the stereotype it's got about a lot of truth to it. lesbians moving in on the second date with a turkey yeah. baster, there's some truth to it. Yeah. <laughs> Chat's Steve. having trouble get uh, understanding the turkey baster remark. It means that they're ready to have, like start a family on the second date. Lesbians are notoriously um, ready to commit. Yeah, is what That's I'm saying. A stereotype. That's a stereotype of theirs. Yeah, hump and dump is a pretty big thing with lesbians, too. Yeah, that's the whole idea, too, I get that. They hump and dump until they're ready to commit, and then it's like, bam. I thought they hump, move in, then dump. Oh, maybe. And then live together in a commune instead of moving out. <laughs> and start a flannel shirt factory. Commune of lesbians. Sweet. <laughs> Fuck, I want to live with them. I know, I am worried about you. <laughs> There's a hole. A bloody hole. I've always been worried <laughs> Becky would... <laughs> Becky. Oh, Becky. <laughs> That's not cool. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe I do want you to go join that lesbian commune. <laughs> if you're gonna keep up with jokes like that. Hey, go bud. frolic with the lesbians and talk about your bloody holes. <laughs> <laughs> Lesbians rarely fly. Write wrong. some, write, write some beat poetry about it. Oh boy. <laughs> about your blame. Jesus Christ. <laughs> hey, video games. Mm. Batteries. Battery. Where? Right there. Ah, uh, you know what? What? That completes the trifecta. What? If I could be anything in the world, it would be a battery. A gay. Jewish fireman. Mm. Well, yeah. <laughs> Tell me that there is yeah. not a happier person in the world no. than a gay Jewish fireman. There is not. Do someone call but a fire? Yeah, I've got a hot fire in my pants for you, you fucking gay Jewy bastard. <laughs> Come over here, you sexy son of a bitch. Uh, that would be my life. Wow. It's <laughs> pretty good. I can handle that. <laughs> What are you doing this weekend? Well, I got a few bar mitzvahs to go to, but I guess I could have sex right now. Ah, uh, it's another it's one of these! So oh, fuck off. The amount of times that's fucked us. It's thinking something's a dead end, but it's yeah. actually a squeeze port. It's a goddamn squeeze port. Squeeze port. <laughs> Speaking of gay men. <laughs>